Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It is your boy, Justin Robertson here. That is the worst intro I've ever done. I will never do it like that again. But um, welcome back to Jurassic World Live. How you doing? You doing good? I'm doing good. Um, Good and bad news. Good news is we are at the April Fool's event and the market is apparently closed. Okay, that was disappointing. All right, so what do we got today? Well, we got a whole bunch, but let's go through everything. <sighs> this, this, this is the first, first thing that actually made me really, really upset. This one actually made me really, really upset, guys. Because I actually was going to work towards Concactola. I, I actually wanted to use him and unlock him and use him. They get, they literally made, made sure now you can stun him. Now you can stun him. And that's fucked. That's really, really fucked. Instant shield. Instant shield and ferocity ability changed. Priority target. Da, 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 what? I just, I, I can't. I can't with Ludi anymore, guys. I really, really can't. So, that's that. Unfortunately for some people, this is going to be an easy event video. First, for a couple specific reasons. Reason number one. Tiny T-Rex. <laughs> reason number two. Another tiny T-Rex. But big reason number three. Baby Mortem! It's Baby Mortem! And what annoys me about this event, guys, is that we finally get a really, really good incubator. I mean, a really solid incubator. Because I would be happy with anything on here besides Tyranno Kyrie, Haas Maximus, and Refrenatum, and Alacranix. I don't want any of those four. The rest of them. I guess I'll take. Mortem, okay, cool. Hydro Ball, that would unlock him. Imperator Sutures, that would unlock him. Come to think of it, it would unlock Alacranix too, but I don't want Alacranix. Hydro's Lux, I don't need it. Sarah Magnus, to a level 29. Gorgotra Max, I guess. But you know what? Do you know what the catch is, guys? You guys want to know what the catch is? You want to know what the catch is? We don't get anything useful. Isn't that nice? Isn't that, isn't that just great? Don't you guys just love Ludio? <sighs> I, I hate Ludio with all my heart sometimes. I really, really do. I really, really do. So, we really don't have much that's useful here. Tenoptosaurus is good. Allogen 2, I guess. But let's go through and check what the battles are going to be. Okay, fine. Cool. Okay. Okay. Getting a little stupid. A little more stupid. Oh, that's really stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. Phenomenal! Fucking hell, man. So now Concactalock is trash. Now he has no fucking immunity to stun. So I won't be using him. I won't be using him because he's basically what Deiratosaur used to be now. Because isn't Deiratosaur immune to stun now? I feel like she might be. Is she? She's a 50% resistant. You, we already know. Deiratosaur never was like that. She used to be completely susceptible to stuns. So, um, let's get straight into it. We don't even get Alberto Spinus, man. That's the annoying part about it. Everything here is, like, just trash. Oh, excuse me. Uh, 
Okay, so the whole video is not going to be this. Obviously not. Honestly, Allosaurus, Allosaurus. Diablo, because why not? Although, wouldn't it be wiser to use Spinosaurus? Play Dirt Rex is going to be with who's coming out first. I see no reason why it wouldn't be. So, hmm. Just for the um, swapping, whatever. So, how are you guys doing today? Um, oh, I didn't even get to look at the events. That's right. I forgot to look at the events. All right. Um, you or you? Let's go for you. Skolosaurus comes out first. Interesting. Which means it would have been better if I put an Allosaurus Gen 2 first. Phenomenal. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, good. You're nice and weak. Awesome. Watch, watch her kill me. Oh, yeah, you're alive. Please get a crit. Of course not. All right. Um, I'm a little, I'm a I'm going to go for Allosaurus Gen 2. Swap him to you. Because I knew you were going to do that. Excuse me. Yes! Thank you. I honestly thought this little shit was going to be faster than me. Yeah, there's no way in hell you're surviving this. Of course he gets a crit. Why wouldn't he? Rattle off sword, I'll take it. Nice, alright. Okay. Alright, well let's take a look at our weekly events today. Uh what do you get? Ooh, the pass is ending soon. I gotta make sure I get that. I don't want to you. Alright, so we get three attempts today at Biza Bufo. And we got Apatosaurus, Platyosaurus, Sukumimus, and Tarbosaurus. Well, guys, it's all really up to you, but go for Apatosaurus. For Notopatosaurus into Geminidus. Also, you can go for Platyosaurus to go into Platyorex. But Geminidus, I feel, is a little more worth it. Platyorex, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I'm not really too, too um, into Platyorex like that, so, yeah. Friday, we have a Marcosaurus, Dreadnoughtus, Giraffe Titan, and the Spinosaurus. 
So obviously, out of all these, your first pick should be Almagro's horse for the Giga, Giga for, for <coughs> Play Topeka and Play Rex. There we go. Whew. Oh, we get the huge triple graph. Awesome. Triple graph is going to be Friday. T yeah, tomorrow will be Behold Lord Life Thornax, which I will be covering that as well. We don't have none today, which is good. Well, a foolish fiend, that might be something. Then come Saturday, we have also the classic T-Rex, Australia Titan, and Toro. Out of these three, you should be going for the classic T-Rex. It has the highest damage output, can pretty much almost one-shot anything in tournaments. So the, the Mattel Rex should be, definitely be the one you're going for. If, you're not, if you don't want to personally go for the Mattel Rex and you have Toro at a higher level like I do, then go for Toro, but I'm still going for the Mattel Rex anyway. Got another Epic, epic Incubator Saturday. Come, now, Sunday is where we get next. Sunday, we have Gemini Titan, Schoonosaurus, and Tyranno Metrodon. Now, this one is where it gets a little difficult. Not really. Everybody go for Tyranno Metrodon. Gemini Titan, whatever. Schoonosaurus is Schoonosaurus's DNA is easier to obtain than fucking Tyranno Metrodon. For me, at least. I don't know. I feel like Sonosaurus, everybody should have a lot, you know. And then the, the, the legendaries is Conchachiosaurus, Gigaspikosaur, and the Spinosuchus. Gigaspikosaurus should be your, if you're going looking for the play T-Rex, Gigaspikosaurus should be your first pick. I'm personally going for Conchachiosaurus since I, I'm already on the road to unlock the Conchachiosaurus. I'm not going to stop now. So you do that. Um, we got... 12 attempts on, uh, wow, Allosaurus Gen 2, Baryonyx, Giganonosaurus, and the Sonosaurus. All right, so for these, for these, this one, the three ones you want to look at is the Allosaurus Gen 2, the Baryonyx, and the Giganosaurus. I'm going for the Giganosaurus because I already have plenty of Baryonyx DNA still, despite, uh, despite of how much I've been fusing it, I still have a good chunk, I, I believe. Where are you at, baby? You're level 20, right? Apparently not. Where is she? Is she where is she? She's over on here somewhere. No, she's at level 26. That's right. I did level up Baryonyx level 26. I still have 4,000 DNA for her. So I'm a, I'm a right on Baryonyx DNA. I'm going for the Giganotosaurus. That's what I'm going for. There we go. Fucking hell. All right. So we got that for Raptor. This one, yeah, not worth it. If it was any other Apex but him, then maybe, but yeah, not worth it. Whoa. Whoa. So, 10,000 bucks, Ludia. 10,000 bucks. And the bucks aren't even on sale. That's crazy. Yeah, no. It's not worth it. N guys, none of these are worth it. None of them are worth it. Not even not even the catalyst things. They're not. Which what's hard is that they're all the same price and it's getting lesser and lesser worth. No, man, no. There's a problem with this damn game, man. A flock bundle, which who really needs that? Ooh, resilient care with a Rexy in it, which is just weird, but okay. Play TRX Fusion, okay. Not bad, not bad. No. No. And no. Okay, so this um that was just a waste of time. So um Oh no, the two reactivates out there. I still don't want you though. So I'm not gonna throw you. A foolish fiend, what is that? Ah <gasps> Beezle Boofo! The Beezel Boofo boss! Yay! All right, so we're going to actually get a face this little guy because I love the be 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 Bezel Buffo boss. There we go. Bezel Buffo boss. Bezel Buffo boss. Okay. Um, Bezel Buffo boss. Rexy probably can handle it by herself. Not, no, not actually, no, not by herself. She cannot, no. Giganix probably could. 
caustic cloth. A three delay. Oh, interesting. Very interesting. Yeah, Gigantix probably could kill it by itself, honestly. All right, Gigantix, let's do this. Oh, look at him! Yeah, I love it. I'm sorry, I love the Bees of Boofer boss. It's fucking adorable to me. And then it shakes. Oh. I remember when this thing first came out. It was fucking adorbs. It was adorbs. I fucking loved it. Yeah. Damn. Bye bye. Frog legs. Which aren't very good, honestly. I was never really fan of frog legs. Foolish frog. Interesting. Dinochatus. Tarposaurus. Yeah. Yeah. I'll definitely take that though. Definitely, definitely take some Indominus Rex Gen 2 DNA. Uh, but, 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 is that just a random Pladio Rex outside? Huh! Well, there we go. I'll take you. You know what's retarded, guys? And it makes me feel really bad. I completely forgot about Tiger. I was, I was supposed to do a collaboration with Tiger tomorrow. Yeah, me yesterday. No, the day before. I oh my God, that's how bad I am. It was the day before I was supposed to do it with him. Oh my God. Wow. And I, I have the audacity to call him my brother. That's crazy. How did I forget? Yeah, because I was too busy dealing with my fucking car. That's how I forgot. Oh wait, no, no, no. no, 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 no. We are not done with the... What's it called? It's this week. All right, so... And we have two full strike. We have a full strike and an ep expert full trial. Nice, nice, nice. So like I said, Giga Spica should be your first choice and Tyrannometrodon should be your first choice for the other one, honestly. Because we got Sonosaurus right there. And Alula, blah, blah, blah. I'm telling you guys, they're, t they're planning something with this damn panda bear. I don't know what it is, but they released that panda bear a very, very, very long time ago. And they still haven't done nothing with it. So, I don't know, man. What are they going to do with that damn thing? Because they released that sh thing a fucking, a long fucking time ago. I think at least a year. Maybe even two. Because he was released a good amount before Beezle Buffo, too. Holy shit. How long ago was that thing released? Oh, my God. Man, that's ridiculous. But we get the Panda Ball Strike on Tuesday. So, guys, to, to recap, Giganotosaurus should... Giganotosaurus or Baryonyx should be your... Or, well, any of those epics is really... Sh it's whatever you really want to do. Personally, I think everybody should have a lot of Allosaurus Gen 2 DNA. So, I don't think Allosaurus Gen 2 should be needing to be darted. Sonosaurus is, just like Brachiosaurus, a pain in the ass to dart. So, I would... Definitely go for Baryonyx or Giganotosaurus. Baryonyx is the easiest to dart out of all four of them, honestly. For this one, Gigaspica, Tyrannometrodon, because Tyrannometrodon is just... Another reason why Tyrannometrodon is better to go for Swinosaurus, especially if you ain't got no Rexy DNA. You ain't got no Rexy DNA? There you go. This one, Amalgosaurus, and... What should the other one be? I think Spinosaurus, because I feel like they're gonna keep on trying, trying to make Alberto Spinus work. Because Alberto Spinus, it's so bad, and they need to do. They need to. 
Alberto Spina shouldn't have been as bad as it was on release, considering it's well. Can't really say that because I mean, we got Alberto Soros who made Alberto Sevilla, which was an absolute menace for a whole year or so. So I don't even know if we can say that shit. Jesus. And if it is still, you go for Apatosaurus and Pladio. But the least I'm going to do today is I'm going to get us up to face at least the um, the first boss. So let's go ahead and go into this one. All right. So Alberto Sevilla can actually go out first. Deiradosaur. The Diablo Ceratops, and if everything goes hits up, then why don't we just put in, oh, I don't know, Dino Chairs. What do you call it? Alberta Sevian should be able to snuff everybody here. Including you. Snuffed! You think I didn't know you were coming in? Oh shit, he's faster. Oh no, he's faster. Oh no, he's faster. But we can't allow that, can we? Night, night! Jesus! Damn! I don't think... No, 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 you're level 27. You definitely can kill it. Oh yeah. Boom. That was quick. So, given that the, the the second round of prizes is Pyrirritator, Magna Pi, Magna Pyrator, Magna um, Raptor is definitely on its way. All right, now we have Dynamicus, the what the fuck is that? Argentavis. How fast are you? Not very fast at all. Good lord. All right. Um. Endoraptor Gen two. Oh, damn, that was a big milk. Alright. I knew you were going to come out first. You have to? I honestly thought she was gonna get a crit, which wouldn't have worked out well if what's his face came in next. Great. Now he's slow. Ooh, I don't need I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Ooh, you. Yo, swap a trial. What are you doing? Uh, we we'll go for that. <laughs> that, that was that was adorable. That that was actually adorable. I can't. That was actually pretty fucking cute. Uh. 
man. <laughs> All right. Nice. I, I, I got. I got. I have to at least face the mini Rex at least once, because I know. I know for a fact I'm not gonna make it to much less beat mini Mortem, but. Ooh, Alessinosaurus. This one might have your name all over it. Yeah, I think it does. Actually, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna soften them up first. Allosaurus Gen 2 could literally come in and pretty much rinse everything. Um, ooh, who else do I want to use? Um, what I'm really worried about is that Stegosaurus and Galatis at the end. That's going to be a problem. This is annoying because all of them have really high health. And 126, 116, no, 113, and 115. Okay. So, Allosaurus Gen 2. Um, yeah, we can bring in you. Why not? Carnotaurus. Overraptor. And you. Remember, this is literally just to soften them up. If he puts an irritator first, that'll probably be the worst mistake ever. But he's gonna put in Bumpy. Yeah, I thought so. Well, Bumpy's almost dead. <laughs> He actually let me kill him. Interesting. All right, listen, bitch. <laughs> I love that. Allosaurus Gen 2 was like, oh, you thought you were slick, huh? <laughs> you can't kill me, can you? No, we cannot. Allosaurus Gen 2 just rinsed this entire team. She did! Oh my god, Allosaurus Gen 2 just rinsed everybody. Wow. Wow. Impressive. I shouldn't be surprised, but impressive. Alright, now we are on to our first mini boss. Yeah, I'm sorry, he's so cute. How fast is this little motherfucker? Okay, good. He's not fast at all. Whew. All right. All right. Okay, okay, good, 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 good. I'm like, what do I see? I like what I see. Um, Parasaurus, obviously. Dear Adsaur makes literally no sense to put put you in. Um, I need distractors. That's what I need. You actually could work. We could bring you. Um, do you have rend resistance? You probably do. I thought so. Um, 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 um. constrictor. And um, should we bring you, Spinosaurus? Nah. Um, Alasino. 
No, no. Try Stronix. I, I, I feel stupid for even asking which one I should bring. All right. Let's see him. Let's see him. I'm excited. I'm excited. Where is he? Let me see him. Let me see him. Let me see him. Oh, my God. He's so cute. He's so small. Look at him. He's so fucking small. Um, ooh, what do we want to do for the first move? Uh, yeah, we'll go for that for you, that for you, that for you, and yeah, for you, why not? There you go. <laughs> Excuse me. How do you resist affliction, bro? Oh, that's how you resist affliction. Okay. He has a counterattack? Wait, what? <laughs> whoa, 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 what? Yeah, he does. Okay. Yeah. Definitely should have looked at that before I did that. Okay. I honestly thought that was already going to be a group hit. I was about to be very scared. Bro, he's fucking microscopic. Oh my god. That shit, that shit is actually adorable. I can't. That is actually fucking adorable. Boom! Boom! Right, carefully don't kill you. <sighs> so fucking cute. I'm sorry, he's actually just... Jesus! <laughs> Knock the fuck out! Okay. Who's he about to hit? Please don't hit me. Oh, well, I'm good with that. You can go with that. The fuck was that? Oh my god! No, you can't do that. No, sir. Oh, fuck me. Flipping hell. Who's he gonna hit? Highest HP, well, yep, that's that. That'll be you, Spinal Constrictor. That will be you. That, my friend, will be you. Ow. Okay. I, is it bad that I feel bad for <laughs> killing it? It's so fucking cute. It was too cute. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, this is where it gets interesting. Not really, because I could still fuck everybody up here. Except for the Dakota Raptor. The Dakota Raptor actually might be the only one that's going to cause a bit of an issue. But Alberto Sevilla could actually probably take out everybody there. He almost, almost takes out Concavenator, which almost isn't good enough. Is it, is it? Okay, yeah, okay, okay, cool, 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 cool.
All right, this is the last one. Last one, seriously. Go figure the Baryonyx comes out first. Go figure he swaps out in the concavenator. And the concavenator is now dead. Let's go. Not like I don't have an ass load of DNA for both of those. All right. Well, that's it. That's it for now. Oh, I forgot to collect those. I'll, if I record another one today. But uh, thank you guys for tuning in. I know that one was a bit boring. But um, I love you all. I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>